We've heard a lot about global climate change, or global warming as it's often called. It comes up time and time again in the news, in political debate, and as a driver for new legislation. Legislation that often affects Cummins and our customers directly. So what is global climate change, really? And more importantly, how does it affect our company and the work we do? To answer that question, we need to take a look at what global climate change means. The fact is, the Earth's climate has changed many times during the planet's history, from ice ages to long periods of warmth. Yet over the past 200 years, the burning of fossil fuels such as coal and oil, along with deforestation, have caused the concentrations of heat-trapping greenhouse gases to increase significantly in our atmosphere. As far as Cummins is concerned, the debate about climate change is over. It's time to take action, and that's exactly what we're doing. Governments and people the world over are concerned about emissions from diesel-powered equipment and the effect emissions can have on the air we breathe, as well as the role greenhouse gases can play in global climate change. To address these concerns, the United States and many other countries are taking a number of steps aimed at reducing greenhouse gases and slowing the rate of global climate change. From improving energy efficiency, to encouraging alternative fuels, to regulating emissions and fuel efficiency standards. So where does Cummins stand when it comes to global climate change? We're committed to being a vital part of the solution. There are really two things that drive us in this regard, and they come directly from our vision and mission. One is that we demand that everything we do leads to a cleaner, healthier, safer environment. And the second is we apply the creative ingenuity required to make us better, faster, and first to market. And those two principles are driving us as we move forward to create products that respond for our customers to reduce the carbon impact and to respond to climate change. Today, Cummins is working with governments around the world to help reduce greenhouse emissions and address the issue of global climate change. And that should come as a surprise to no one. Cummins has a deep commitment to corporate responsibility that extends throughout our history of developing ever more energy efficient solutions for the marketplace. Cummins has created 10 principles for climate change to help direct our action and to guide our thinking on the subject. These really build on our long heritage and consistent history of environmental responsibility. The first six of these principles describe things that we can do, things that we can take action to do ourselves from product efficiency improvements right through improving efficiency in our plants and engaging our employees to help us continue to make further improvements. The last four principles really have to do with policy, as we're working with policymakers to help develop responsible regulations to create support and incentives for the application of new technologies and to engage more broadly in business practices uh, that align with our technologies to improve climate change. The Cummins climate change principles can be seen every day in the work that's being done at Cummins. In our plants and facilities, we have internal initiatives to reduce, reuse, and recycle. Through the EPA Climate Leaders Program, we have made a commitment to reduce greenhouse gas emissions in our operations by 25% in 2010. The 25% reduction is against a baseline established in 2005 and is adjusted for sales. This is a substantial reduction in greenhouse gases. But Cummins plays an even greater role in finding solutions in the products we provide and the solutions we deliver for customers. Consider that fuel economy represents the largest single cost factor for most of our customers. Carbon dioxide emissions are directly related to the amount of fuel burned. By increasing fuel efficiency, we reduce carbon dioxide emissions. Cummins has been doing basic research for many years on how to improve the efficiency of our products as well as how to reduce the emissions to make them more reliable, more durable, all the things that our customers expect. As far as we're concerned, uh, climate change, CO2 reductions, and fuel economy are really two sides of the same coin. So the work that we've been doing to improve the fuel efficiency of our product is directly aligned with reducing CO2 emissions 
uh, and reducing our impact on climate change. How much of an impact has Cummins had? You be the judge. From 2004 to 2008, Cummins completed 44 customer-focused Six Sigma projects, which resulted in a savings of 40 million gallons of fuel globally and more than 400,000 metric tons of CO2 eliminated cumulatively. This is equivalent to taking more than 74,000 passenger vehicles off the road. How does Cummins make this kind of impact? By using the power of Six Sigma. For instance, by using Six Sigma methodology and tools such as PowerSpec, Cummins Six Sigma teams have helped customers take advantage of features such as load-based speed control and gear down protection to improve efficiency. Cummins is the only engine manufacturer that uses Six Sigma methodology with their customers and customer-focused Six Sigma projects. This type of activity strengthens bonds, uh, shows the customer Cummins commitment to working with them as a partner, and also allows our customers to achieve significant savings on an annual basis. Clearly, Cummins is having a major impact on helping customers reduce their CO2 footprint. But that's not all. By working closely with our suppliers, we've also been able to help them reduce their CO2 output. When it comes to global climate change, Cummins is working across the board around the world to provide innovative solutions in our operations, for customers, and for suppliers. One of the phrases that guides us in Cummins as we do our technical work and also developing our business is innovation you can depend on. And we remind ourselves that the depend on part is just as important as the innovation part. So as we create advanced technologies that allow us to reduce CO2 emissions and improve fuel efficiency, we recognize they've got to be reliable, they've got to be durable, they've got to deliver good value to our customers. As you look to 2010, our engines integrated into modern trucks with modern fleet management principles being applied will deliver the best fuel economy in the history of the industry and deliver the lowest carbon footprint at the same time. And that's what we call innovation you can depend on. When it comes to global climate change, Cummins is delivering solutions.